If you have an extensive menu, it can quickly become cluttered, even if you are using categories. A streamlined, intuitive menu will enhance your customer's experience, and even encourage repeat ordering. This tutorial will walk you through some of the ways to quickly make a difference to your menu. All of the settings to do with categories are edited in TouchOffice Web. Navigate to Products, select any PLU and click the Webshop Options tab. Finally, click Edit next to the current web category. First of all you will want to organize your categories so that they are grouped in a logical order. This can easily be done by dragging and dropping. A good starting point, as in this example, is to have all of your food and drinks next to each other. This will ensure your customer does not miss their favorite dish. While this has helped, you can see that the menu is still quite overwhelming. Utilizing subcategories is a great way to combat this, and will enable you to group similar categories together. In this example we will create a main category for all of our drinks and relocate our existing drink categories within it. Once the category has been created, we will need to edit our existing categories so that they know where to appear. This is done by editing the category name to start with the parent category, followed by a colon. As you can see, we now have our draft beer inside our drinks category. Go ahead and repeat the process for the rest of the subcategories that need to appear within that category. For our menu we will also want to repeat the process and group our food items. Once again, create the main category and continue to amend our existing category names to turn them into subcategories. Now that this is complete, you can see that our customers will have a much easier time of finding what they are looking for, and the menu is far more intuitive. In this example we will go a step further and group our spirits and wines together to further streamline the menu. Additional sub-category containers can be created in the same way as before. Create a new category in drinks called spirits. Next we will point all of our spirit categories at that new category, by editing the name with the new path, separated by colons. Repeat the process for the remaining spirits. Next, we will do exactly the same for wines, and add our bottles and buy the glass categories to it. Drag the categories to the order you would like them to appear on the menu. Remember that the subcategories will have their order dictated by their parent. Hopefully you will agree that our drinks menu looks far less cluttered now, but it is still easy to navigate. Last, but certainly not least, ensure that you upload new category images for your new categories. This is done by editing the category and navigating to your selected image. For best results, these should be 960 by 640 pixels in size. For more information on any of these points, please contact your ICR Touch partner.